a lot of work goes into the broth. There's a lot of that stock from the prawn heads and the shell. Oh wow! Hey, hey guys. guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are gonna head over to I Prawn Me and Assam Laksa food truck. They are very popular for their prawn mee and today we're going to head over there and try out the best selling dish. Yeah, their food truck is located at the Sea Park Market right at the corner so you guys can head over there and pick up your food as well. So without further ado, let's go get our food. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, we've just come back home with our food and we just popped this into the oven for about 2-3 minutes to make it nice and hot. Whew, bowl still hot. So I've actually went ahead to order a little bit extra. I have ordered the pork ribs and also the additional egg. And it looks so good. Just look at the dish, it looks so amazing. It has so much of the ingredients. You can see how red that broth is as well. So the most important thing of a prawn noodles is the broth. A lot of work goes into the broth. There's a lot of that stock from the prawn heads and the shell. And it's no wonder you cannot see any of the shell or head attached to the prawn. All of it went to the stock and goes into the broth. Let's try out the broth right now. They've actually added in some, some of the chili paste in there as well and some blachan. All right, let's try out the broth. Oh, wow. It's so thick with that prawn stock. Really, it's like almost like eating a prawn itself. It's like the whole prawn is swimming in your mouth right now. It's that awesome. It's so thick. Mmm. So the noodles I've ordered is actually a mix of the yellow noodles and bihun. I'm just gonna try the noodles. It's already soaked up a lot of the soup. Mmm. Mmm. The broth actually is already absorbed into the noodles. Wow, I tell you that broth is seriously cow. It's a bit salty and has that sweetness from the prawn and that fragrance. Wow, I can't wait to try out the pork ribs right now. Wow. So it's another additional four ringgit for the pork ribs and one ringgit for the egg. I'll, I'm gonna try out the pork ribs. Hmm. Wow, that's a bit chewy. The meat is nice and tender. And that flavor of the pork, it has a bit of that sweetness in there. Oh, it goes really well with, with this dish, really, really well. There's actually quite a few chunks of this pork ribs as well. So I think four ringgit is actually pretty worth it. So that pork ribs is actually coated with that chili paste as well. So it has a lot of that chili flavor in there. It's, it's wow, it's so good. I'm gonna have some of that prawns as well. Oh. And also there's a kangkong. Need to have some greens, right? <laughs> no matter how little it is. Mmm. Oh. I nearly burned my tongue, but it's so good. Wow. Alright, it's my turn to try the Asam Laksa right now. It's really hot. We pop it in the oven. I'm gonna try the broth first. You can see like a little chunks of fish in there. Oh wow! Straight away you can taste the fishiness and also the tanginess because of the tamarind. It is a very hearty bowl of soup. Mmm. I'm gonna try the noodles now. Mmm. That noodles just glides through my throat. So good. I really like the laksa noodle that has a little bit of translucent colour. I really love that texture. I see lots and lots of chunks of fish in there. Some onions. I don't know where the pineapple went to. You can see some slices of cucumber as well. The soup is overall a little bit more sour. You can taste the fragrance from the hako, the shrimp paste. The asam laksa is overall very hearty. I really love the soup. I wish there was more hako I would put into it and you know add some additional sweetness and flavour to it because I really love Every time I eat asam laksa. 
both the prawn noodle and the asam laksa is really good but I have to say that the prawn noodle here is definitely the winner. Yeah, absolutely. That has one of the richest broth I've tasted from a prawn noodle so far. So, a lot of the prawn stock, very very flavorful. Yeah. So this food truck is open from 12 p.m. to 5 o'clock and I think they're closed on Mondays. We'll share more information about this place in the description below and also you can check out their Facebook page as well. And if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to us if you like to see more of our travel and food videos. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Bye, Bye guys! guys.